All right, hello everybody. This is my first video that I will be posting on this YouTube site. It's about the 2012 DA14 asteroid that's going to come pretty close to planet Earth in the year 2013 in the month of February. Roughly around February 14 or 15. You know, happy Valentine's Day, right? In this video, I will include NASA's trajectory animated graph showing the coordinates of this asteroid. Um, I know when I think of an impact of an asteroid, I think of the year 2029 or, or 2036. That's what comes to mind, meaning Apophis. You know, at, at, at that scheduled to come pretty close in the year 2029, 2036. Apophis, you guys and girls can look it up. This is new, though. I mean, it's scary to think that such an object with such a potential threat was discovered just now. I mean, I truly feel that more money needs to be put into NASA. Um, you know, there are real threats out there in space. Just as we prepare for wars here on planet Earth, I feel that we should prepare, you know, for other unworldly events, so to speak, or things that threaten Earth from other worlds or space, such as asteroids, aliens. I know a lot of you guys and girls might laugh when I say aliens, but you never know. Anyways, what's your guys and girls opinions on this? I mean, do you what's your thoughts? Do you think that this 2012 DA14 will actually be the one that that really does hit or uh or not? Please like and subscribe. Thank you. An asteroid of the same class as one that allegedly detonated over Tungus Caribou in 19. Oh, it will pass by Earth next year flying closer than some man-made satellites, according to NASA. The asteroid, 2012 DA-14, will miss the planet by 26,900 kilometers on February 15, 2013, which is closer than satellites in the geostationary orbit of 35,700 kilometers, according to data on NASA's website that was published on Sunday. The asteroid, first detected by the Spanish Observatorio Astronomico de la Sagra, is between 40 and 95 meters in diameter and belongs to a polar group of near-Earth asteroids, many of which are potential collision hazards. Astronomer groups around the world are continuing monitoring 2012 DA-14 to determine its size and trajectory. The estimated size of 2012 DA-14 places it in the same category as the celestial body that scientists say, exploded over Western Siberia in 1908. Though many theories exist concerning the event on Pod Kamene at Onskus River, the leading explanation is a space body more than 50 meters in size blew up in the atmosphere, the blast being at least 1,000 more powerful than the nuclear bomb that destroyed Hiroshima in 1945. Song of desire. 